Welcome to Emergency Insights. I'm James Carter. Today, we're dissecting a cornerstone of emergency medicine, the evaluation of chest pain. For healthcare providers, this is a daily challenge, demanding precision and a systematic approach. Our primary focus must always be a comprehensive history and physical examination. This is not merely a formality, but our initial crucial step in discerning life-threatening conditions from benign etiologies. Illicit details regarding the onset, character, radiation, and alleviating or exacerbating factors of the pain. Concurrently, a focused physical examination can reveal vital clues, such as signs of heart failure or aortic dissection. Following this, the application of validated risk stratification tools is paramount. Here, the heart score stands out as an invaluable asset. Utilizing its five components, history, ECG, age, risk factors, and troponin, we can effectively categorize patients into low, intermediate, or high-risk groups, thereby guiding our subsequent diagnostic and management strategies. This evidence-based approach minimizes unnecessary testing for low-risk individuals while ensuring aggressive workup for those at higher risk. Speaking of diagnostics, the judicious ordering of tests, particularly serial electrocardiograms and troponin levels, is crucial. Routine blanket ordering for all patients is neither cost-effective nor clinically sound. Instead, integrate these tests thoughtfully based on the patient's presentation, risk stratification, and dynamic changes in their clinical picture. Remember, the trend of troponin levels, not just a single value, often provides the most meaningful information. Ultimately, an individualized disposition plan is required. This may range from safe discharge with clear follow-up instructions to inpatient admission for further observation and management. This decision must be based on the totality of clinical data, the patient's risk assessment, and an unwavering commitment to patient safety and resource optimization. We are continually striving for patient-centered, cost-effective care without compromising diagnostic accuracy or therapeutic efficacy. Thank you for joining me on Emergency Insights. We will continue to explore critical topics in emergency medicine in our upcoming episodes.